All right, here's a look at the date and time on the LG Spectrum. It is currently Monday, March the 20, or excuse me, July the 27th at 1.35 p.m. And we are here at the Computer Sciences Building. We're here to ride the elevator. This is the first part of our elevator montage with the Samsung Galaxy Tab 4, as promised. Go to four. Door oh, close button does work. Oh, yes. Okay. It was a little busy here. and stuff. I have my tablet's cover off because on my initial test it had rattling sounds because it had a big bulky survivor tablet cover on it and I decided to take it out and start new. View of Clark. Then we got ThyssenKrupp and Plant Sciences. They have Dover Classic and Montgomery. Yes. <sighs> Sorry, it was just really busy here a while ago. I tried to film a little bit earlier. Couldn't really do much. Now it's all good. Ready? That's good. Take it down. Here it is. Lantern cam. Let's go to one and get a cab view. Just your basic ThyssenKrupp Aurora elevator. Kind of nice though. Is it closed now? Yes. There we go. And that is the elevator at Computer Sciences. See you at Clark. Or excuse me, not Clark. Next up is going to be Plant Sciences. All right, here we are at Plant Sciences. And as we all should know here, the elevator is at Dover. Oh, look, here it is. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Right. Go to two. Hmm, something at one. 
Oh, that's strange. Just stopped at one. Hmm. Here's a view. You can see Clark again. Let's go to E. Let's go to E. Door closes when you push the button, like that. Here's a cab view. Just your basic Dover um, classic cab. Kind of a little dark, but that's okay. All right. Let's have a look at the closes. There you have it, folks. That's plant sizes. Oh, bye. Wow. Okay. All right, that's plant sciences. All right, here we are in Clark. Building A, and then we'll do A and B. So y'all should know the Tissen Group. A nice one too. Go to B. Let's get a cab view here. I wrote this one a little while ago when all the lights were burned out, kind of. With uh, vandal resistant stainless steel, as Elevating Denver had pointed out. Go to 3R. Let's watch, listen to the motor and watch the numbers. Oh wait, hang on. Uh-oh. Okay. <sighs> oh, that was a little nerve-wracking. I thought I'd gotten stuck in the elevator for a minute. We'll just have to go up floor by floor. I do apologize. Yeah, because I thought I was going to be stuck in the elevator. That was freaky. <laughs> Didn't move for a second. It's like... I thought I was going to have to ring the alarm bell. All right, here we are at 3R. Oh, thank goodness. That had my heart racing there. Oh, n oh, nilly. Whew. Yeah, that scared the living crap out of me.
can upload videos longer than 15 minutes by default. So I'll see if you can cram in maybe a couple more elevators. I'm thinking at Education Willard Eddy. Here is the, um, the walkway I was talking about back in 2013. As you can see, nothing much has really changed. Jeez. Ooh. Probably won't ride that piston cart for a while. That, that kind of scared the pants off me a little bit. All right, here we are. It's hard to pee. And it appears we have some construction. Sorry about the music. Anyway, Cubs Rule 2040, I know you'd like these. Because he's been filming vending machines from time to time. Oh, we might have someone. Getting in with us now. No, it's fine. And resistant fixtures. And I've come to the conclusion that this is a U.S. elevator. Let's watch the lantern. It's got that Epco gong or the Adams gong, whatever. Let's go to B and get our cab view. Just your basic elevator. I imagine this is a US because of the indicator. That telltale indicator is a US. And there's that annoying buzzer. And we're going to B so I can hear the motor. Go to one. And I think this is gonna be the last video actually. And now let's watch as it closes. And those are the elevators at Clark Buildings A and B. See you next time for our second part.